I'm sorry, buddy. Stop it's, a rude, it's a rude awakening. Come on, Max. We're going for a ride. Look, we're going for a ride. Come on. Let's go. Where are we going? Colorado. Max, you ready to go for a ride? It's 6.37. All right, so we're gonna make some adjustments to our uh, luggage situation. This thing on top is not worth the crap. We're only an hour into the trip and it's already came loose once. It makes a lot of noise. This door does not close very good, so we're gonna try to fit all the luggage in the back. We're just gonna put bags throughout everywhere, so it's gonna be fun. Okay, I think we did it. Hungry? Are you hungry? Max, Max, look. I'm eat. He's distracted by all the smells. Right now we're about two hours behind schedule, almost two hours behind schedule, because we've had to stop so many times because the kids had to go to the bathroom or get something to drink or get gas or let the dog out. Now we're stopping to let Max out to eat and drink and hopefully pee the whole time every time we've let him out he hasn't gone to the bathroom i think maybe and he hasn't drank any water either so hopefully now he'll drink something he'll, he'll use the bathroom outside we're about an hour and a half from albuquerque our arrival time is about 5 30 something like that what do you think about the road trip are you having fun are you having a good time Look, we're gonna have a window view. Look at that, Mindy. No. Can I have the key card? Of course. Push, push, push. Yes. Right. Let's go. Yes. Ooh. This is fancy. Oh, wow. Oh. Pretty big. This is big, huh? Yeah. So this is the first time we've ever had a doggy in a hotel. I've been annoying this entire thing. Yes, you have. Yes, I have. What do you think, Max? What do you think? I think that is great. Because, because whenever you get hot, this is our, like so this is our view. You watch the building. You have to do this. Yeah, there's the air conditioner right here. They're, they're building oh. something. They're building something over there. So we are backed up to the back door here, unloading everything. It was pouring down rain a while ago. As you can see the uh, water gushing out there. But it stopped, so it's time to unload. It's dark outside, it's loud outside. We just got back from eating at California Pizza Roll, is uh, what Ava likes to call it. And now we're gonna go check on Max. He's been in the room by himself for about an hour and a half. Hope we didn't go crazy. Hope we didn't pee or poop in his little cage. Hopefully he's laying on his back, crashed out. Oh, but he's gonna get so excited. Oh, man, I wanna see him. You have the key. Look at him. Feels like it's Christmas. Hey, Max. Max! We're home, buddy. You didn't pee or poop? We're home, buddy. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey, Max. Did he really? It smells like pee. So we will get up tomorrow and head to Telluride. You ready to go to Telluride? Maybe you can ride the gondola. That'll be fun, huh? 
Just don't poop in the room tonight, okay? Just don't poop in the room. You can sleep in that bed. Huh? You wanna sleep in this bed tonight? You can have the whole bed to yourself. Hey, Max. Hey, just don't be in the bed, okay? So here's the deal. It is 2 a.m. and I'm outside with Max because he has yet to go to the bathroom outside. This whole trip so far, he has not gone to the bathroom outside. He barked earlier, woke me up. He got a drink of water. And uh, so I'm outside with him. Hopefully he'll, hopefully he'll go outside. Uh, he's gonna get pretty full and constipated if he doesn't. It is 10.52. We just, well, I'm getting gas right now. We're about five hours from Telluride. We stopped and got some donuts. Stopped and got some Starbucks. Stopped and got some Dutch Bros. Max pooped outside, first time. Since the whole trip, he pooped outside. So that's good. He hasn't peed outside yet though, so hopefully that'll come next because he did pee in the room this morning. So then I went to let him out and uh, I was waiting by the elevator. And of course he, he's peeing next to the elevator. I'm like, oh no, I gotta get him out of here. So we go to the stairs. He didn't want to go down the stairs. So I had to drag him down the stairs. And while he's while I'm dragging him down the stairs, he's, he's peeing all over the stairs. And he pees on my foot. Finally get him outside. And then of course he didn't pee. And then like at 1.15, I think, I took him out again. And maybe it was two, maybe it was five. I don't remember. I took him out three times last night. So we're in the elevator and he pees all in the elevator. I'm like, oh crap. And the elevator opens and some guy's coming out and there's like pee all over the elevator floor. <laughs> so I grabbed a couple of wipes and wiped it up real quick. There's uh, Max's pee all over the hotel. No. But at least he pooped outside. Now let's talk about that more. Look at him. Look I'm at so him. proud, I'm so proud. There's a dog. There's a dog swimming in the water. I bet Max would love to go swim in the water, huh? I think it's that guy in that truck. I think that's his dog. Hey, hey dog! Hey, hey, hey! He's all shaking on me. Go, go. Go back to your go back to your owner. You sure he's not a wolf? Stop. Ah, get out of here. Go. Go. Get. Get out of here. Go. He listens. It's a little after five and we made it to the room where I'm on a little balcony. This is what, uh, this is what's behind me. Other rooms and balconies. Man, and it feels good. It's like 57 degrees. One thing I've noticed about this place is there's never really a lot of people. During the summertime anyway. I guess during the winter everybody's everybody comes here to ski. There are a lot of dogs though. This is definitely a dog friendly town. A lot of dogs everywhere. He did it. <laughs> he finally pooped outside. And he's peeing. He's peeing right now. Oh my god, he's peeing. Dang. 
That is a long pee. He's still peeing? He's still peeing. Oh, whoa. 30, 30, second. 40 seconds. And I didn't hit record for probably 20 seconds. That's a minute long pee.